The group that claims to be behind the hate messages posted on the campus at SMU over the weekend is now taunting police. Campus police released images of five possible suspects from surveillance cameras at a nearby strip center. The vandals posted pictures of themselves on social media with the banners they put up but the men concealed their faces. Fox 4's Allison Harris is on campus tonight with more on the hate speech investigation. Allison. Stephen Clarice, the group that's behind this has 25 members. It's called Texas Vanguard, and their organizer tells me they do some kind of mission every month to get their message of white supremacy across, and their target for this movement in particular was SMU. Two men salute white power but hide their faces behind black masks. A fascist white supremacist group called Texas Vanguard tweeted these photos of signs they put up at SMU Sunday night. One reads, white men save your people, reject the opioid beast. The other says overdose deaths have increased and most are whites, saying protect white lives now, signed Vanguard America. I mean, I hate literally nothing more in the world than that. It's demeaning to see that people still think that they can act like that. The man who says he organized this movement on behalf of Texas Vanguard would talk to us over the phone only and would not give his name. We want a white America. We want a, we want a fascist white America. SMU released this surveillance photo of five men believed to be behind the signs that have since been taken down. SMU police are looking for these possible suspects. That's not really a concern to us. I, the best I can say is good luck, I guess. While the messages are offensive, they're protected by free speech, not illegal. But a university spokesperson says those involved could be charged with criminal trespassing. The leader that we spoke to would not say whether any are affiliated with the university. Why have they not come forward? I would assume because they don't want to be charged with crimes. Last year, Texas Vanguard put up white supremacy flyers at the University of Texas. This organizer says he chooses to post these messages on college campuses because they result in the biggest backlash. Do we hate other races? I wouldn't say so. I'd say we hate living with other races. We hate having our culture ripped down and torn down and made a mockery of. The organizer says Texas Vanguard is fascist, so they do support police. Yet but these people will not come forward to police as police are looking for them? We believe that their authority is being misplaced. And tonight, the National Vanguard America group is tweeting at SMU and SMU police, taunting them, saying, I know who they all are. If you give me $100,000 cash, I would be glad to give you such information. I did ask this man that I spoke to why no one with this Vanguard Texas group or Vanguard America will come forward and let themselves be identified. He told me that he would be deemed the worst kind of monster.